The main protagonist of the Taverina Valley is its landscape, where ravines stand out as deep cuts in the hills. Here, no kind of vegetation can grow, for the continuous processes of the erosion of the marine clay, which was started two million years ago by rain and frost and by torrents, and was later increased by deforestation. Water excavates cracks which become wider with time. They engrave the hillsides where slopes are alternated with steep walls and peaks in the shape of blades. The clay layer is at the bottom, while upper layers are made of tough and igneous materials, the result of the eruptions of the Volsini Mountains volcanic district. Watching the peak where Civita di Bagnoregio rests, it becomes easier to understand the stratigraphy of these hills. Civita owes its fame and its unique shape to the phenomena of landslides and the geological processes of erosion. To collect more information on the territory's morphology and its geological history, it is advisable to visit the Museum of Geology and Landslides in Civita where displays are dedicated to explain the attempts made in order to contain these destructive phenomena which threaten the village survival. In Lubriano, the trail dedicated to water, flowers, fruit and edible herbs created by the Nature Museum introduces to the visitors the whole Taverina Valley ecosystem. Walking the three kilometers of this circular path, it is possible to reach the heart of the valley and reading the panels to get to know its flora and fauna.